Hey guys, welcome. Yeah, so in this video, I'm going to show you a proof of why the sum of the interior angles of a quadrilateral has to be 360 degrees. Um, okay, cool. Um, so let's start. So to start, let's draw a generic quadrilateral. I've intentionally drawn our quadrilateral so that it doesn't look like any of the familiar quadrilaterals we know. It doesn't look like a rectangle, a square, and so on. All right, cool, 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 cool. Now, if we label the angles, the four angles, starting with this one, uh, being alpha and then beta here, and then um, theta here, and then delta here, then what we want to show is this, which is we want to show that alpha plus beta plus theta plus delta is equal to 360 degrees. Well, to do that, which is to prove this, um, let's do this with our uh, given quadrilateral, which is uh, cut it right here by this line, this purple line. And then let's label eight angles. Alpha there, as I said, and then beta there, as I said. And so these are the measures of uh, this angle and this angle. And then uh, the measure of this angle is theta. And then finally, delta. As I said, we're going to label eight angles. So not just these four, but also this angle right here, we're going to call angle one. And it's linear pair, we're going to call angle two. So clearly, angle one plus angle two is 180 degrees, right? And then we're going to uh, label this angle right here angle three. And one more, which is that angle adjacent to it, angle four. So now three plus four is 180 degrees. OK. Now, to start our proof, other than labeling our visual, let's begin with this, which is um, call this sum, which we're claiming we don't know yet, and we're going to show then that S is 360. But yeah, since we're claiming right now that we don't know what the sum of alpha, beta, theta, and delta is, let's call it S. Okay? Then, uh, what we're saying basically is that the sum of four angles in a quadrilateral is called S. Okay, fine. It has the value S rather, not just called S, right? The sum of the four angles of a quadrilateral we're saying has the value S. Okay, then by that logic, alpha plus one plus four plus delta is S. And uh, for exactly the same reason, beta plus two plus theta plus three is also S because like right here we have a quadrilateral within our original quadrilateral, and we also have a quadrilateral right here within our original quadrilateral. Now, uh, what we have will imply that um, alpha plus one plus four plus delta blah, 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 you can read, is 2s. Basically, I've added this to this, and that should make 2s, right? OK, cool, cool, cool. And then, and then from here, uh, First, we could rearrange this sum of eight angles in this fashion, right? And then next, we see that uh, since we said alpha plus beta plus theta plus delta is S, that this equation here, second to last equation, so uh, this last equation here, uh, reduces to or simplifies to this equation, right? Okay, and then subtracting S from both sides, we see that... Um, Angle 1 plus angle 2 plus angle 3 plus angle 4 is equal to S, just like alpha plus beta plus theta plus delta is equal to S. Now, if we can show that 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 is 360, then we've succeeded in showing that alpha plus beta plus theta plus delta is also 360 because they're both the value S. But surely 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 equals 360 because... As we said earlier, 1 and 2 are a linear pair, so they add to 180. And then 3 and 4 are a linear pair, they add to 180. 180 plus 180 is 360, which shows the desired result. Yeah? Okay, cool. All right. I hope you enjoyed this, and keep watching. Take care.